Okay, we have here today another integral from the University of Math Society, problem 162. We have the integral of 7 to the x times e to the x dx. Okay, to get started with this, it's a little unusual looking, but because we have the same exponent on the 7 and the e, so what I can actually do multiplying those together, we can just write this as 7e all to the x. But then what we have here is just a constant. This is just being called this a. Now what we do when we have a constant for the base, we can use this trick where we write a as just e ln a. So for what we have here, for 7e, I can write this as e ln 7e. But for this here, I can use log properties on this and write it as e ln c plus ln e. But ln e is just 1. So what we have here is just e ln 7 plus 1. So then taking this and putting it back into our integral, what we have here is we have e ln 7 plus 1. But then I've got this x in the exponent. What I can do is distribute that in and write it like this, dx. But then we can just go ahead and integrate. This is just a constant here. So I can just integrate this as e ln 7 plus 1 times x over the constant, which is going to be ln 7 plus 1. But then just doing this in reverse, what we have here, we find this value right here. This is the same thing as 7e. So we can actually leave it like this, but let's put it back in this form. And I can write my solution as 7e to the x over ln 7 plus 1. And actually, let's get it all the way back to this form. Just to be polite, we don't really have to do this either, but let's just write it this way. 7x times e to the x over ln 7 plus 1 at a plus c, and that's it. Okay, there you have it. Quick problem from the University of Math Society. Thanks everyone for watching. Have a good day.